Before we get started, make sure you like this video, subscribe to our channel, and click on the bell for notifications for every new video that we post. Hey guys, it's Christina and welcome back to the channel. I am here to do our next segment in the crystal series and today we are going to be looking at this beautiful piece of desert rose. Now desert rose is a type of selenite and selenite, for those of you who don't know, looks like this. And that's a pretty, pretty gorgeous piece of uh, crystal right there. But uh, we'll do selling it on another day. Today is all about desert rose. So take a look at that. Look at how gorgeous and gentle it is. You see these little ridges here. You can tell how they look just like selenite. But the difference between selenite and desert rose is that both are formed in saltwater basins where the water has dried up and selenite is left over from the salt and the silt. But desert rose is formed obviously in the desert and the sand creates all these little crevices and nooks and crannies and it makes this beautiful rose shape. So take a look at that. Look at, you can see where all of the sand has pushed through, creating these crevices. Very nice. Awesome. So desert rose. I call this the confidence stone. This is the stone that you hold on to when you are looking to uh, remember your self-worth to jack up your confidence, especially if you've got a project or um, some situation where you need to be at your very best. This is a stone that meets you where you are, your emotional level, and just brings this boost of self-esteem. But it is very gentle, and I keep using that word, um, forgive all the noise behind me. I've got to film outside because the sun is just not here today and there's no light in my apartment. Um, anyway, what I was saying, <laughs> the desert rose is very, very gentle. Um, if you put it in water, it begins to dissolve because it is part salt. So keep it dry, but don't be surprised if you set it down and you see little flakes of selenite wherever you leave it. So that being said, I want you to focus on this desert rose right here. And I want you to think about all of the things that you wish you could do, but you tell yourself, I don't have the talent. I don't have the time somebody better could do that. That's not for me. And I want you to feel the desert rose just wiping away all of those negative doubts, those fears, that anxiety, reminding you that you can, you are powerful, you are smart, you are creative. If it's something your heart truly desires, you will find a way. Close your eyes and take a deep breath. Inhale all the way down to the bottom of your lungs and exhale long and slow. Inhale and feel that beautiful cleansing white light of desert rose coursing through your body with every breath, cleansing your mind, your heart, and your spirit. 
feel it connecting with your solar plexus chakra and your sacral chakra, reminding you that you are creative, you are powerful, you have the potential to be and do anything you want. Deep breath, inhale, and exhale. And as we always end every meditation on this channel, keeping your eyes closed, place your hands over your heart, and repeating to yourself, I am blessed, I am loved, I am powerful, and I am more than enough. Namaste.